Hello you beautiful people, welcome back to another Plays video. Today we are going to be talking about the new inventions and Vibra cards. So with the new New Year's events, we have got a selection of new Vibra cards and inventions. So let's jump into say Aokiji, who I know who doesn't have anything. And what I haven't checked is if we've got new runes, so I'll quickly check that too, but that seems to be fine as is. So let's go in and check the new you know, inventions and then we'll go into Vibra cards and then we'll go into dials as well. So we have made a video recently talking about the, 10, the 100 ton hammer. Um, but we haven't made one talking about the new diving bucket, which is the brand new item. So once every 10 normal attacks has a 50% chance to trigger self, sorry, grant to self an ally with the highest attack AOE damage resist. This is another item that's going to give us damage resist. That is absolutely insane. It also gives us 15% ultimate damage resist, 15% hockey damage resist, and lasts up to 8 seconds. If HP is below 50%, gain 30% crit. Sorry, yeah, 30% crit damage resist for 8 seconds. This is giving damage resist out of everywhere. This is utterly insane. And then as we start up, we're going to be able to get just higher percentages, which is absolutely fantastic. Guys, I mean, with how these new items are coming out, we're getting a lot more hockey attack into the game with the new sets and the new gear. Again, more hockey attacks come to the game. Having actual hockey attack damage resist is kind of huge. This is going to be up there as one of the better tank slash support items. It's, I mean, on top of that, you're actually helping your teammates out as well. This is, this is definitely a very, very, very good item. And it's very affordable as well. The, through the event, you're going to be able to pick this up pretty easily. This is, yeah, no, this is very good. And I mean, very good. And if you can star it up, it's even better. So, wow. Okay, I'm, I mean, we've already talked about the golden hammer and the ten ton hammer. I, th I think. The, the the old hammer is better than the new hammer so i won't go into it there will be a vid there is a video in on my channel go and check that out and i'll so that way we've sort of covered everything but the diving bucket is fantastic and definitely one i would want um moving on to the viva cards now we have talked about maglan again in that last video but bartholomew kuma is the new one and if anyone's read the newest chapters kuma's got a special place in my heart at the moment so let's hope this is fantastic when the battle begins, increase max HP by 30%. No change to current HP. Wait, no change to current HP? Oh, right, okay, there's a full stop there. That just afterwards heal for 4% of HP loss per second. Oh, so this is this is meant for a tank. This is definitely meant for a tank, where you're gaining a ton of HP, and then you're healing 4% every single second that you're losing. Alright, it's nothing crazy like being super honest this isn't crazy but it can be very very good so i think if you build someone with a lot of defense a lot of hp this is going to be absolutely nuts so someone like big mom is going to love this who's got naturally tons of hp i like this i i do like kuma i think kuma's a fantastic another addition i think if you're gonna go for your team i think more you finally gets dropped out i think you run kuma and you run all of these in your team and you know you've got a pretty solid team because most of these are attack enel and Actually, comparing this, would you prefer gain shield? At, would you prefer to gain a shield and immunity control on your tank, or to heal? And I think I'd rather get the heal because I could put the shield and immunity control on someone like you know my healer. Yeah, no, I think that's absolutely you know brilliant. Um, looking at dials now, safeguard, thwack, and counter. We have talked about all three of these. These are absolutely broken, and if you get your hands on any of them, you are going to have a massive power increase. They are unreal. Now, going further down, we do... I don't think we got a new dial, actually, in hindsight. Because Garda, we've already talked about. Purifying, we've already talked about. We don't have a new dial. I thought we did, but we don't. So, there is no new dial. But that is okay, because the two things that we did get are unreal. Now, if you want to get your hands on the new you know, inventions and your cards, there is a very, very easy way. So you're going to need to come into this event. You're going to need to top up the 648. That's going to give you the 30 uh, pieces here. Of course, you're also going to get the Luchi pieces, and that's all good. Now, to get um, Kuma, you're going to need to top up a lot more. So we're not going to talk about Kuma too much. But assuming you can only do 648, that is the one you want to do. And then you want to use your diamonds. You should have, hopefully, some diamonds you should be able to buy the other seven over here and that will get you what you need which is going to be the one star version of that 
Uh, within here, you're going to be able to get the counterattack dials. But again, you're going to need to spend a lot to be able to get to where you want to be with it. And there isn't anything else, unfortunately. So there is no other way to get Kuma by the looks of it. So the only way we're going to get Kuma at the current moment in time is through those 80 fragments. And that's through topping up. So that's over here. That's 80 fragments. And honestly, even if you top up more, you are not going to get more of that. So unfortunately, we can't even get Kuma at the moment fully. Now, as you top up, you are going to get the Thwack dial. And I mean, guys, if you can't afford it, 100% that is a fantastic dial to have. It is absolutely game changing. So maybe consider it. I mean, for those of you who don't know what it does, I will quickly, quickly go over it. So when the battle begins, you get a 30% HP increase. And when casting your ultimate, you gain 20% ultimate damage up for six seconds. Now it deals Haki damage to a single target of 10%. And this is where the uh, where this new you know invention is going to come in, where we've got all this extra Haki damage coming out. But all in all, it does a ton of Haki damage and it does a ton of damage in general. So this is an amazing, amazing dial. Uh, another one that's super, super good. Again, you really kind of want is this new safeguard dial. I think it's really OP. Um, but anyway, boys, I won't keep this video for too long. I want to try and keep these videos nice and concise for you guys. So I hope you enjoyed this. If you did enjoy this, throw a like, throw a subscribe, share it with your friends, do what you need to do. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Thank <laughs> you.